every generation has its defining challenges. Due to exponential growth of greenhouse gas pollution, our generation is facing many. Flooding, heat, biodiversity loss, extreme weather. Our choices compound climate-related impacts when we build in harm's way and when our infrastructure intensifies the hazards themselves. The result? The costs of extreme events have risen dramatically in recent decades. Let's face it, adaptation and resilience need to grow apace with the costs and impacts we are observing. If you're in a, a storm or say a perfect storm situation, the boat and everyone in it may be threatened. And so the idea is we need to get control of the boat. We need to right the ship. We need to get it back on course. We need to work the sails. We need to steer. We need to keep our system safe and intact. And so we want people all together working toward these common goals. Climate service providers simply can't afford the slow spread of good ideas and results. To accelerate the pace of adaptation, we can cooperate to improve and sustain the ideas and practices that advance our shared priorities. Given the contrast between flatlining federal dollars invested in this space and the mushrooming need that we have for decision services at locations all across the country, we must develop a new uh, and shared and more sustainable model by which we collaborate on developing these tools and providing expertise equitably all across the country. Imagine the rapid spread of great ideas, best practices, and proven methods. Imagine multiple sectors simultaneously adapting, mitigating, and improving equity. Imagine exponential growth. We must think this way from now on if we're to bend the curve of climate change, keep up with the impacts it deals out, and bring our shared values to fruition. We need clear strategies that people can quickly understand, adopt, and pass along. Throughout history, if there was an outbreak of a fire in an urban community, we would see people come together and form a line. They called it a bucket brigade. By collaborating and working cooperatively for a shared goal, they could much more effectively fight and put out the threat of the fire. We do have a common goal. Grow the adaptation field exponentially. Join us to discuss how to reach that goal using resources we have on hand. I'm encouraging recognition of and participation in an open, inclusive community of adaptation service providers who collaborate on producing the needed outputs, those building blocks that reside in the open access, open source domain, but that are available for the benefit of all. Our conversations will steer funding toward our work as individuals and as a team. It's up to us to define our strategy, objectives, and goals so that together we can face some of the greatest challenges of our generation and win. Brilliant goal! Rose Lavelle might have won the World Cup for the United States with a fantastic goal!